So I have this lovely friend named Mickey GP on YouTube and she decided to start her own tag, which is pretty cool. And she tagged me in it. It's called the queries tag. Her first question is, what is your favorite childhood memory? And I thought about this for a while and at first I couldn't think of any childhood memories. It would be about my first grade teacher, Mrs. E.B. and she had taught in Japan and she went to school in Japan and so she had a lot of Japanese influenced things in our classroom. She had kimonos and low tables and these cool dishes. We used to go to the Japan closet at recess instead of going outside and we would play Japan at recess and she would just let us kind of hang out in her classroom and dress up in the kimonos and pretend like we were having sushi. I just remember that very fondly and I remember thinking that was the greatest thing. Sometimes I would go to school and play Japan at recess and then I would come home after school and make my mom play Japan with me at home. The next question is what is your favorite movie and why? And my choice is Children of Men. It's not very well known but it's a dystopia in which people are infertile in the future and one girl ends up finding out that she's pregnant and it's this big whole thing of trying to protect her because she wants to keep her baby instead of having to give it to the government. And it's just beautiful. It's beautifully filmed. And the reason that it's my favorite movie is there's this scene in the middle that is all one take. There's no cuts in it. And it is just absolutely beautifully done. It's an action scene too. So that's even more impressive. And it's just Oh, it's the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen. Who is your inspiration and why? I don't have one specific inspiring person. Lots of people inspire me in various ways. I would say the people I did Vita with this past year definitely inspired me throughout the month to stay creative and stay on top of things. I get inspiration all over. One person who I follow on Twitter wrote kind of a snarky tweet and I ended up turning that into a flash fiction piece and that was one of the first things I had written in months so I don't know why I found that tweet particularly inspiring. What are you most passionate about? I would say I'm most passionate about helping others to learn and whether that's learning a specific subject or learning to be a better person or learning how to improve themselves. I just want other people to be able to do things on their own and if that involves my teaching them to do something then that's what I'm very passionate about. What would you name your children? At this exact moment I don't really think that I want kids but I have a couple names that I like. They're all boys names <laughs> even though if I were to have kids I would want girls. I just watched The Spectacular Now and the male protagonist is named Sutter and I think that's a really cool name and I also like the names Blake and Elijah. For girls I just feel like there's so many names and I don't know what I would name my girl. I would want something that's sort of unique but not too unique kind of like my name so I don't really know I like the name Tori but I have a friend named Tori so I feel weird like saying that I like the name Annalise but there's so many ways you could spell that and also you could also pronounce it as Annalise and I don't like having to correct other people about my name so I wouldn't want my child to have to always correct other people what size shoe do you wear I wear usually about an eight and a half sometimes an eight and sometimes a nine cookies or brownies Almost always the answer will be brownies, unless it's those peanut butter cookies with the Hershey's Kiss in the middle. I'm not gonna tag anyone specific to do this, but I will put the questions down below if you'd like to do it, and I would love to watch your video, so let me know if you do, and also let her know if you do. I'll put her link down below as well. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you soon.